guys, Matt Edwards here from Vought RV, and today I'm going to show you the new 2022 Jayco 174BH bunkhouse, and I'm going to show you all the new features for 22. Starting off is, of course, the colors. Jayco changed the colors up for a bit lighter color with a gray bottom. I think it's kind of nice looking, nice and clean looking. This is a fiberglass sided wall unit, okay? They make it in both. You've got your power awning up here with your lights. Another new item for Jayco this year is they're putting the speakers on the outside instead of on the, uh, the awning arms, which is a little bit better sound quality, okay? Of course, Jayco always has the American-made Goodyear tires, okay? These aren't the Japanese Pop Pops. These tires here have an actual six-year warranty from Goodyear. Plus, all Jayco's has galvanized steels up here in the steel well, in the wheel wells. This is in case your tire was to separate or tread. It doesn't beat the crap out of your trailer, okay? All righty, we got an outside plug over here. You can plug a fan, TV, whatever you're doing on the outside, on the entertainment side. We've got our tinted windows, a G220 tinted, okay? I really like this now. They're putting the magnets up here, okay? That keeps it from bopping on your head. Underneath, you've got your storage and your all wood construction, okay? No pressed wood, all plywood, good lumber, okay? Makes it hold up better. Jayco gives you a three year structural warranty on this trailer, okay? All righty, moving along the side, we've got our crank tongue jack, okay? Now this trailer lengthwise is 21, 21 feet 0.6 inches, okay? So 22 inches from the very tip to the bottom over there. Weight-wise, it's 37.50. So a lot of y'all have asked, well, my Ford Ranger or Tacoma pull this. Normally on the small trucks, they'll go up to about 5,000 pounds, so they'll pull this real easy. Some Jeeps will pull these too. So if, you're, if you have a question, just put it in the comments below, and I'll answer you back on what your vehicle can tow for you, okay? All righty, moving around over here. This is our fill tank. This is for our freshwater tank on here, okay? Also for 22, all the Jayco's are coming pre-wired with backup cameras and side cameras. So pulling this again with you know a small SUV with side cameras, seeing your surroundings is a really great feature. Okay. 22 also, they don't have the cord that you have to pull out and stuff back in. This cord unplugs, it's easy, it's lightweight, my wife can handle it. it just may, it's a lot cleaner, I think. Okay, we've got our water heater right over here. Automatic light. Our city water connections right here. Now when you guys get a trailer, I always like to tell people to get the elbow right here. You don't want your hose going in like that and sinking. So get the little brass fitting where your hose goes up this way, okay? Okay, you've got your gray and your black down here. And we go through and teach you everything about your trailer, okay? Whether you pick up this trailer or a Pinnacle, we're gonna spend two to three hours with you going over all the aspects of the trailer, how to use it, okay? This is a great uh, first time trailer, okay? We've got your cable and satellite plug in, okay? A lot of the parks you go to will have that, so it's just real convenient to plug into, okay? Come around to the back, full size spare tire, again, a Goodyear tire. You are pre-wired for the backup cameras. And Jayco has a really neat safety feature on here. Whenever you're turning left or right, of course, this will blink, but a light up there will blink too, as well as the whole side of the trailer. So that way, if you're at a stoplight or an intersection and your guy two or three cars down can tell which way you're going. Kind of cool. All righty. Well, it's, I'm sweating pretty good, so let's go inside. All right, welcome inside. I just checked the weather, it is 93 degrees outside, and it is pretty nice and comfortable inside of here, even though we're in the sunlight. Uh, we order campers the way we want to, way we want to camp in. This is a 13.5 unit, which is plenty of AC for this size of room. It's not a side unit or a little bitty small one. This is a biggie, okay? Now, one of the things you're gonna notice for the new for 22 is the Modern Farmhouse interior, okay? This is the white cabinets, we call it Modern Farmhouse. And they've done quite a few changes over here. You know, Jayco still has all wood construction, no staples, all screwed and glued, okay? They gave you a little bit bigger countertop in this one too by reducing your stove, okay? Instead of the three burner, you've got a two burner over here, which is high output. 
and of course no oven in here okay they went to a single sink so that way it gives you more prep room over here you've got your GFI plugs your cable hookups your your uh, TVs all your gauges are all right over here lights and awning okay plus it has the new black faucets for the new year let's see look at that hey, we're, we're going through it right now whenever you see the pink stuff in these trailers it's actually antifreeze from Indiana okay alrighty so coming along this side again it's modern farmhouse see how light it looks and how big it looks and this is I believe is a 60 by 70 queen bed okay sitting on a piece of plywood real wood not particle board and you have access down here to your storage okay which makes it really nice and neat and convenient okay this trailer is wired for solar panels if you so choose want to add those okay we've got some deep storage up here above the bed and this one's kind of nice too if you're a tall guy and you're sitting up you're not going to bunk your head up here okay all right we've got a two-person dinette over here that also folds down and makes to a bed but you know it's a pretty good size i can sit over here pretty easy we've got our lights we've got our windows that open up our nice blinds okay moving along this way we've got a dual refrigerator in this one okay that runs off electricity and gas okay so that way you're able to boondock in this one okay if you wanted to this trailer will sleep five to eight people okay your bunks over here are all plywood no pressed wood no uh, particle boards okay and you've got access to storage down here too so for a little bitty trailer, it's got some pretty decent storage in through here, okay? Now these bunks, the single bunks over here will hold 300 pounds, so that means if I could get up here, it'll hold me, okay? All right, moving on to the bathroom. This one has the tub in it, okay? Now if you stand in a trailers and notice and kind of bounce a little bit, you can tell a difference. With Jayco, this is all plywood and two by fours underneath here, so it's solid, okay? A lot of them you'll step into, you'll kind of sink a little bit, okay? And I'm about 5'8", so, you know, a six-foot person could come in here and do this, okay? You got plenty of squat room down here, okay? You got a mirror back here. Uh, all around, it's just a, it's a really great little trailer. Um, it's priced under the $27,000 mark, so it's easy on the pocketbook. You can get a low payment on this one, you know, probably lower, a lot lower than your car payment for sure. But any questions, uh, hit the subscribe button, uh, come down and see us. I'm Matt Edwards, my phone number and my email address down there below. You're more than welcome to come out, look, hang out with us. Y'all have a very blessed day. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching our video. If you have any questions, be sure to drop a comment below. Or if you have any suggestions on content you'd like to see, we'd love to hear about that. Go ahead and give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks again from Vod RV.